What is up, you guys? Welcome back to another episode of A Day in the Life of a Paralyzed Man. Today is episode nine. I really appreciate all the love that you guys have been showing. We're about to hit 100K on the channel, and I couldn't be more grateful, you guys. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support that you guys have been showing. You know what? It's time for me to move forward. I feel like I've been going in circles, you know, with, you know, what me and Cassandra got going on. And it, it, look, it is time for me to officially move forward. She's moving forward with her life. I'm going to be moving forward with my life. Um, and I'm looking at hiring a cameraman. It's a lot of things that I want to film that I'm not able to because, you know, I'm in a wheelchair. And then also with the whole thing with what me and Cassandra got going on, it's hard, you know, because when I ask her to help me film sometimes, you know, we start arguing and I don't really get the best footage possible. So I'm looking at hiring a cameraman. Let me know what you guys think about that. I got a trip coming up that I'm thinking about, you know, planning. And of course, I want to bring you guys with me. Um, so yeah, I need somebody to help me film that. So, uh, yeah, I'm, look, 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 I'm trying to do some big things on the channel, okay? We're about to hit 100K, so we got to take this thing a lot more serious. I'm trying to take my, my eating habits a lot more seriously right now, so that's what I got to do. I got to go ship a couple things off. I want you guys to come with me. So let's do this, man. I love you guys, man. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support that you guys have been showing, man. Let's do this, baby. Let's go. Come with your boy, though. Let's go, though. Let's do it. Your boy just left about the post office right now. I feel like that that's what's going to be a little bit different. It's like the little things that I can ask Cassandra to go do whenever she's out. It's like I can't ask her to do no more. So it's, it's like, you know, I got to start doing these things for myself. And that's okay with me. But it's just... It's new, you know, so it's just something that I'm not used to. And, you know, I had to go ship off this package and, you know, I would have normally asked her, but, you know, look, I got to start doing things for myself and I'm okay with that, man. My Look, look, I'm at peace. All right, I'm at peace and I, I'm good with that. So, man, look, let's do this, man. I got a couple more things I got to go set up. I want to go set up a uh, like a P.O. box and I also need to go set up like a business account. So, your boy got to go do that. So, we about to go do that. Come along with your boy, you know. Let's go, man. I love y'all, man. I love y'all, man. Man, appreciate it, man. Thank you guys so much. I might go get me a Starbucks drink too. I'm thirsty. Yo, your boy just got pulled over, man. Alright you guys, so the cop let me off with a warning. I didn't even realize I was speeding, you guys. Like I really didn't even I wasn't even thinking. I had the music playing and I really just didn't even realize that I was speeding. But shout out to him for letting me off. Like he realized I like I like I had the car on, on cruise control. But I'm about to go into this Chase Bank right now and I'm about to go set up a business account. Cause I have like my money going into all one account, which I shouldn't be doing that. Alright, so your boy about to go up here, set up a business account right now. And yeah, so let's do that. So look, I went to the bank. And I can't set up a business account because they don't have no bankers <laughs> in there. How do you not have any bankers in the bank? I don't know. Chase, you got to do better. All right, you guys, so look, I came home really fast because I had to get some lunch, all right? And then also the battery on my camera is dying. Look, I don't know how it's dying, but it's dying. But I went and got this Energy Bite drink. And also I got something for lunch. So I'm, I'm starving right now, you guys. I worked out earlier, so and I didn't eat anything for lunch. So I was like, you know what? Let me grab something. And then after this, I'm going to head back out. So yeah, man, look, I appreciate y'all coming with me, man. And shout out to that cop for not giving me a ticket, though. He was, he was pretty cool, though. So yeah, let's get it. Dude, these were the, hey. Oh, uh, look at him. Look, he, look, he ready to eat. He ready to eat. <laughs> this guy really ready to eat. <laughs> All right, so he done. <laughs> <sighs> look at him. What's up? Whew. So you ready to go, baby? Let's go. Woo! There we go, baby. I'm at the store right now, and I ain't gonna lie, I've just been sitting in the car, man, just thinking. I ain't gonna lie, you guys, I'm hella scared. I'm 
I don't know. I don't know if I'm like just afraid of what to come or like I don't know, just finally like being on my own. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I'm a little, I'm a little scared. It's like I got this like feeling in my stomach. Yeah. So, you guys, I am finally home. Um, today was one of those days, you guys. I really just kind of been in my mental a lot. Uh, I've been thinking, you guys, and, you know, look, I just got to move on. I got to move forward. Um, I've been thinking a lot about the past. I've been thinking a lot about the future. And I feel like that the future is just kind of something that just kind of scares me. Um, you know, like, I love Cassandra to death, you guys. I know she loves me to death, too. Um, it's just, you know, we at that time where we both we both got to move forward. We both got to, you know, go on with our lives. And it is what it is. So, yeah, it's been kind of tough. I, I've been... I'm going to just leave it at that. Bye.